Hi there, Dave here from Ivy Cottage. I'm going to just do a little video today. Um, I found some seeds underneath this hazel tree we've got. Uh, I hadn't got a clue what they were, so posted them to a forum. Apparently they're cyclamen uh, seeds. Or um, So I'm going to have a go at harvesting some of these. Um, these little things here on the... I'm going to have a go at harvesting some of these seeds and see if I plant them up and get some extra seeds so um, I'll show you the way I'm going to do it and we'll see if any of you have got any better ideas of how to do it so uh, see if they're successful. time to do this is sort of end of June time and the test is when the seed pods are a little bit squashy so you can squeeze them and break open the pod. Um, yeah, I can just squeeze that between my fingers and just about squeeze it so I'm just popping them all in here. Um, the thing is with these you need to get the seeds out and um, you need to soak them overnight because the little seeds inside, which I'll show in a minute, are covered with um, a sticky hormone that stops them from um, germinating straight away. The idea is that they, uh, they only germinate when there's been enough rain on the ground. So, uh, and the sticky substance, ants and things, which I can see quite a few of down here uh, like to carry them away so it's a sort of clever adaption that they've uh, they've had so there's a few more over here I'll see how many I can see how many I can find so uh, and then I'll try them in a shady spot like this again next year so I'll just pick the rest of these so I've got Joseph my little helper for this bit um, so I've picked all the pods the idea now is to squeeze them out um, and you'll see inside the, sort of, the little white seeds there, see if that's focused in. in. And what I'm going to do is shake all those into here. And just pop all those in like that. So that's all the seeds out. So we've got quite a lot in there and they are extremely sticky on the outside. So what we need to do now is just put some fresh water in there um, to rinse them off and a couple of drops of normal detergent and just give that a swirl round and then leave that for 24 hours and then we'll plant them. So we'll pick this up tomorrow. So we're picking up the uh, cyclamen seeds actually a few days later, I haven't had time to do it so I'm just going to show you what to do. You can see that the liquid has changed colour, um, the seeds at the bottom there look clean so all we're going to do with that now is I'm just going to tip them through a sieve and uh, rinse them off and then I'll show you what to do with them next. The next step then is to get some kitchen paper, take the seeds and spread them out onto the kitchen paper, giving them a little bit of room each. And what we're going to do then with that paper is then we're going to fold it up we're going to place it inside a zip seal bag
and we're going to put some water in there as well just to moisten all the uh, all of the paper so we've got moist paper seal it up I'm going to put that somewhere warm for about 30 days and then once you've done that the next thing you need to do then is to take those out they will have germinated slightly and you'll see just the little sprouts coming out you transfer those into a tray of gritty compost that you've wetted um, and cover them over with a light film of compost and that's that's it you should then have cyclamen so I'm gonna wait a month I'll make another video show you how I got on if you've got any comments to make about a better way to do it then please feel free to drop the comments in below so thanks for watching, hit subscribe, have a look through some of our other content um, and uh, look forward to some more in the future. Thanks a lot, bye.